seeing that we have featured uh, a, a lot of startups out of campus, and we have just had a, uh, you know, a talk from one of uh, our academic innovators, we introduced a new element in, in this uh, session that we haven't had before, because it occurs to us that uh, the companies that make ILP possible are also quite important, and we can't feature all of them, and they don't always want to be featured in a long talk. So we have some very brief lightning talks from industry here. They're all members of our program. And note this, the lightning talks for startups are two minutes. The lightning talks for industry is 30 seconds. <laughs> Welcome to Canon, Virginia, and Curtis. Thank you for allowing us to be here today and part of the Startup Exchange. So let me start off by explaining Canon, Virginia. So who is Canon? Canon, Virginia is one of 50 uh, manufacturing sites worldwide, uh, a global scale. So we are actually in Canon, Virginia, located on the eastern seaboard, we're there actually as a contract manufacturer to support all Canon uh, activities within the Americas. So that includes both mass production as well as aftermarket support. We have a wide range of activities including our research and development. We have uh, activities such as uh, injection molding so we can actually take you from design all the way through manufacturing and help you get into the market. So we're here today actually to let you guys know that uh, as a manufacturer, we're here to help you. And Canon's uh, footprint is not just uh, in the United States, we can also go global. All right, thank you. Thanks very much. I'm now looking for Max from ENI. Hi, everybody. Max Pieri from uh, ENI. ENI is um, one of the ma major oil companies worldwide and uh, is also currently engaged uh, in the, in the transition be, uh, from uh, an oil company to a 360-degree energy company. In order to do so, we would be very happy to liaise uh, with uh, startups uh, to understand if there is a room for cooperation and see what we can do together. Thank you very much. And Max is very humble here, but they uh, have already done so because they're smart and they already have an opportunity open on, on Startup Exchange, so you might already apply and you don't have to see him here in person. If you're shy, you can basically go online. But no one's shy, so. Um, next up is Schneider Electric. Andy? Good afternoon. I'm Andy Hahn. I'm the Chief Technology Officer for Schneider Electric's IT business. Schneider Electric's a 26 billion euro turnover company in the uh, energy efficiency space. We uh, sponsored last weekend the uh, uh, energy conference that was here um, as a uh, one of our main activities tied to our campuses. We have five campuses, global campuses for our R&D sites, one here in Andover, uh, then we have them in Bangalore, Shanghai, and uh, Monterey, Mexico. We're opening one in the Silicon Valley region as well. We're here trying to engage in open innovation, drawing in startups close by and adjacent to our campuses. And again, it's all focused in Schneider Electric around the best use of energy, both in the products, the services, the buildings, and then ultimately how you all take advantage of that power. Uh, last up is W.L. Gore and Associates. Where is my friend? There he is. Welcome, Mark. Thank you. I'm uh, Mark Dunn. I'm with Gore. Um, you may be more familiar with Gore-Tex, one of our brands for the garments. Um, we also have a medical division that does uh, grass and stents, or I, I call it plumbing for the body, but if you see them, don't tell them I call them a plumber. Um, I'm in our electronics and uh, industrial division where we have a lot of technology in uh, filtration, separations, as well as dielectric materials for um, things like uh, high temperature film capacitors or insulation for motor windings, that sort of thing. Uh, we're kind of a poster company for uh, a poster child for a company that pushes a core tech material out into many products, and our expertise is in fluoropolymers, specifically PTFE or Teflon, where we have a lot of expertise in the manipulation of that polymer. 